Just one of the buildings in New Orleans lighted in blue for law enforcement day. And there's an artist on the West Bank who is also a sheriff's deputy. WGNO's Kenny Lopez shares the man's best work painting officers killed in the line of duty. First and foremost, I, I always gain permission to paint the fallen deputy. And once I'm finished, I try to meet with the family before the service. That way I can present the painting to them and have it on display at the service. For 11 years now, Rodney King's been memorializing fallen officers killed in the line of duty on canvas. I just hope that it gives them hope. And also I hope that it kind of gives them a sense of appreciation for their loved one to pay in the ultimate sacrifice. It's always emotional when Rodney gives the paintings to the grieving families. A lot of tears, a lot of thanks, a lot of hugs. I was actually in the mortuary business for 10 years and just embalming people, you kind of, it's kind of the same idea because you're trying to memorialize them, I guess regenerate their essence and their soul onto a canvas. For him, it's even more personal. I'm a, a deputy sheriff in Plaquemines Parish, and it could happen in the blink of an eye for me, you know, on a traffic stop, on a call. Rodney's now branched out with his art, having his first ever art gala this Saturday night at the Stained Glass Wine House in Gretna. When we found out about Rodney, we knew that that's something we wanted to do because it's near and dear to our heart, being a first responder who also wants to have a creative outlet for their passions. And it's absolutely beautiful what he does. And at this gala, they'll be unveiling one of Rodney's brand new paintings. And you see this Pelican painting right here. They'll be raffling it off with proceeds going to help for heroes. It's a foundation that helps with the families of fallen first responders or fallen police officers. And it's these heroes that Rodney wants to give his heart and art for. And I feel like that's the best way you can memorialize someone is for an artist to put his time, his heart, and his passion onto a canvas. And that raw emotion, to me, that's what it's all about. Kenny Lopez, WGNO News. In St. Charles Parish, a